So does he want to help Nerf or fuck him? every time I'm doing something with the microphone. But we're here for Cam Cam. I had like, just like that little, like, it was like a tiny tickle, so then like that, <coughs> I took care of it. And it was just so weird. I have the right <laughs> So we're here for Cam Cam episode 9, David Gets Hard. What? Episode 9, David Gets Hard. It's the name of the episode. I'm not describing myself here. I think we're officially done. Bye. We've got our reactions. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we're also, well, we've also been talking. And because we're still trying to boost our subscriber count, um, I blame this on the Italian brandy. But um, we are going to do a yeah, special... Yeah, I can't chew rice with this in my ear. Right. It's like echoing. The special being that if we get to 250 subscribers, we will go ahead and tell everyone the referencing we keep making, spattering of our videos, you'll see it here and there, for the poop cookie story. And I, I will tell the poop cookie, cookie story. poop cookie story. It's a poop cookie story. People care. I don't know. People I guess care. we'll find out. <laughs> Yeah. If you want to hear it, you can subscribe. Fair note. The Poo Cookie story is about her. But I'm going to tell it. Because she will downplay the Poo Cookie story. Make it seem reasonable. It is reasonable. It's not reasonable. It is completely 100% reasonable. It's and it makes poop cookies. Sense. It makes 100% sense. Poop cookies. 100%. <laughs> I'll tell it. But don't you always get it wrong? No, I don't. He doesn't. He doesn't, doesn't do it right. <laughs> Look, I'll tell it, and then you can retell it. How about that? Because I actually tell it right. No, you don't. Yes, I do. No, you don't. You don't get the moral of the story correct. That's the whole point of it. <laughs> okay, also, we'll practice. You can also get to point mix up with the crapping on the bed. Yeah, you always end up... No, you forget parts. Thing. You forget parts. I'm sorry. Who is the better memory between us? Look, you also bring up the bed Me. poop. <laughs> That's between us. You don't count. He is between us. <laughs> <laughs> I bring up that because it's also valid continuation of poop cookies. It's poop cookies too. Drop trowel. Why is it called drop trowel? Because that's what you said. <laughs> <laughs> I think I did when I first told Claire the story. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a you out of dropping trowel. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to hear this story and you haven't subscribed, subscribe. And when we hit 250, we will tell you the story we'll of poop cookies. We'll make a whole video of just poop cookies. And drop trout. <laughs> In the meantime, we're here for camp camp. And, and Clara will have to be involved because oh, yeah. the story was told to her. Oh, she can be involved. It's the little engine that could. Well, it'll go on there with the little engine that could because it teaches you things. It's a very important lesson that everyone needs well, to learn. Well, one of the one of them was to her the dropping trout one. Yeah, poop cookies was to him. Really? Yeah, 17 oh. assignments, remember? Oh, yeah. I've told you the poop cookie one, though. Hmm? I've told you the poop cookie one since. I've told her, and you tried to correct me. Wrong, but tried to correct me. Anyway, back on topic. <laughs> also, if you watch our last video, I'm sorry it was so quiet. Um, we're still, we have some sound issues not helped by the fact we were drinking. So we were overcompensating. We were like, Lars is least. Hi, everyone. How are you doing? 
so hopefully the audio will be better in this episode. Anyway, stop. He's testing the audio. Mm -hmm. So you're going to hurt the people who have headphones in the ears? <laughs> and then Clara woke up. <laughs> that was quieter than what he just did. But that was also over there. Close but to that her was <laughs> Let's just go ahead and talk to the actual sound that I was given. Again. Alright. <laughs> Could you, you just do drop it. water all over yourself? I do. Um, I'm I'm you know what? I grabbed too many pieces of ice. This started to hurt. <laughs> I'll put my headphone in. You guys, you know, do whatever. Why'd you keep it in the mouth for so long, man? I was trying to get all the little pieces, mm. so then all I had left was the big pieces. You guys ready? Mm. Here we go. Because the big pieces have consistency, I like this stuff. TGIF, kiddos! Boy, has it been a week! Monday, we went base jumping for Arid's Extreme Sports Camp. <laughs> Tuesday, we froze Harrison alive for Magic Camp. I can fix that. Wednesday was a double whammy for arts and performance. Do not move a muscle. And all of these hilarious props and gags are courtesy of Thursday's visual comedy camp. <laughs> Thursday's over, Scotty. Go back to your tent. <laughs> so, Gwen, which camper are we focusing on to wrap up the week? Uh... Oh, no. Come on, co-counselor. Who's it going to be? It's Nerf. <laughs> Oh dear, <laughs> Nerf's camp? What camp did Nerf sign up for? Nerf didn't sign up for a camp. His parents signed him up for behavioral correction camp. Boot camp? Fuck yes, scare me straight! In all seriousness though, if I don't see definitive results, I'm contacting my parents. I don't- and Don't be a fucking f <laughs> Oh, tell him you touched me! <laughs> <laughs> There's a place I know that's tucked away A place where you and I can stay Where we can go to laugh and play And have adventures every day I know it sounds hard to believe But guys and gals, it's true Camp Campbell is the place for me and you We'll swim through lakes and climb up trees Catch fish, bugs, bears, and honeybees There's endless possibilities And no, that's not hyperbole Our motto's Camp Adium And that means I'm telling you We've got archery, hiking, soldier rescue, viking, horseback, training, that'll save from a heart attack, too, but out of my name, keeping up with rhyming, football, limbo, science, stunting, food, has spaceships, treasure, hunting, bomb, diffusing, no refuse, or fantasy, circus, trap, fees, and fights, and ghosts, and fates, and snakes, and knives, and chess, and dancing, wait, just camp. camp. Right. We knew this day would come. I don't know if I can do this, Gwen. Camp is supposed to be about learning and having fun. Well, we're gonna learn that little shit some manners, David, because we are contractually obligated to. I am not moving back in with my parents. But I'm not tough enough to run a boot camp. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you may not be tough enough to run a boot camp, David, but I can teach you. Teach me? Oh, yeah. Teach you how to be mean, how to be hard, how to keep kids like Nerf out there from walking all over you. After all, there's only one camper at Camp Campbell worse than him, and it's me. What do you want? Double dessert, no activities for a week, and David's social security number. Done. Gwen! Shut up, David! Okay. No! You can't just back down the moment someone gets in your face, idiot! Yeah! You gotta stand up for yourself! I can't do this alone, which means you've got to pull yourself together! Gosh darn it, you're right, Gwen. Today's the day I get hard. Okay, maybe we don't phrase it like that. <laughs> oh no, rule one, no backing down. Look out, world, I'm hard and I'm coming. Whether he likes it or not, Nerf is gonna let me in. Mm -hmm. Owie. So does he want to help Nerf or fuck him? <laughs> All righty, Nerf. It's high time we whipped you into sh <laughs> We're adults, I swear. I swear we are mature. <laughs> I 
Uh, Sonny, now I am confiscating that pocket knife. <laughs> You're pathetic. And getting blood on my boots. Guys, I just don't know if this whole tough guy technique is going to work. What if we just, I don't know, give him a hug? Those always make me feel better. No hugs! <laughs> you just gotta change your perspective on life. Tell me. How do you feel about your co-counselor, Gwen? Well, she's smart. She helps me run activities. No, no! You're being positive again! Gwen's the fucking worst! She slacks off, reads garbage, and has no idea what she's doing with her life. What? <laughs> There's no time-traveling doctor coming to save you, Gwen! Get your shit together! I just want to have his British babies! <laughs> <laughs> now, it's your turn. <laughs> Nerf! I've got a bone to pick with you. Let him have it. Now this may sound harsh, but gosh darn it, I don't think you're very nice. In fact, I'd go as far to say you're mean. Okay, let's dig a little deeper there, idiot. Right. I know that's probably hard to hear. No. And may have even been a little too far. Not at all. But by golly, it seems to me like you've never been very polite to anyone. God damn it. I just don't think you're aware of the impact your behavior is having on other campers. But, you know, if you are aware of that, then that is some good self-awareness. Okay, now you're just complimenting him. So, the tough love approach, huh? You know my uncle believed in tough love? Turns out Child Protective Services didn't, though. Excuse me? Assuming I've always been bad is pretty narrow-minded of you, David. Did it ever occur to you that maybe I'm just a product of a judgmental, overprotective society? Uh... I mean, you chew one Pop-Tart into the shape of a gun, and BAM! In school suspension! Suddenly you're labeled a problem child. You're not like the other kids. You're bad. So then you get sent to a place where other kids perpetuate the same negative mentality, making you worse so that by the time you return to normal school life, you actually are bad. Thus continuing the endless cycle of crime and punishment until all that's left is a little boy. A little boy who only believes he can be what the world tells him he is. A loser. A lost cause. A bully. Nerf, I am so sorry. Whatever, dick turn! <laughs> Man, he is way more fucked up than I thought. You two are idiots. Being tough isn't the same as being an asshole. You guys gotta take this from a more psychological approach. How would you know? As a matter of fact, I dual majored in psychology. So you have two useless degrees. Yeah. <laughs> what are you suggesting? Well... You sure you don't want to get in on this whole nerf-centric adventure today? Yeah, I'm good. We'll probably do something crazy next week. Oops! Didn't see you there! Just kidding, I was fully aware of the situation. I'm just acting out for attention. That being said, I do think I need corrective lenses. My mom just won't take me. Nerf! I think it's time we all had a little talk. Oh, so we're doing the whole Freudian thing now? Everyone wants to fuck their own mom. Get over it! <laughs> Be strong. Nerf, we feel as though you have a relatively strong grasp on the events that have led to your negative behavior, and we wanted to walk through them with you together in the hopes of finding a solution. This isn't going to be easy, but we... And he's cutting out, and like, it, like it's turning off or something. Really? Mine's fine. Yeah, I know, it's only mine, because I keep hearing yours every time this one comes, like, turns off. Have you guys charged them recently? Well, if they weren't charged, then that one would probably mm -hmm. wouldn't be charged. I don't know. 
I mean, this is the best ten dollar headphone Target offers. Are you ready? Okay, this works. Nerf, we feel as though you have a relatively strong grasp on the events that have led to your negative behavior, and we wanted to walk through them with you together in the hopes of finding a solution. This isn't going to be easy, but we think- PUT THE KNIFE DOWN! <laughs> ah! But we think that this is the only way we're going to get to the root of your issues. So, Nerf, what do you say? Well, I think it all started when I joined the ballet. Sorry, Julius, but we have to keep going just because that's a weird place to pause. Okay. <laughs> so we don't have ink blot sex on screen. So what should we do? I guess get the other headphones. More technical difficulties. Okay. I don't know where they are. So after 20 minutes, I think we finally got it fixed, but we had to go back to the old headphones. Damn it. I have to make it go out wide so it doesn't slowly so it doesn't make too much noise. I know. So we're going to go back to you. Okay, are we ready? Let's go. I can't even do some push mine. It was like. Started <laughs> when I joined the ballet. Oh, wow. Oh, it turned down? That's mm -hmm. cute. these behavioral problems seem to be stemming from a vast variety of issues. But what's truly important is that I don't allow society's labels to define who I am. That choice belongs to me and me alone. And I think I finally understand that. I think so too, Nerf. So, what are you gonna do now? Stab someone. Stab my dad! No! What? Why? I don't know. To break this cycle? What do you expect? I'm just a kid! Eat my farts, butt nut! <laughs> <laughs> She says, what do we do? And where does he keep getting knives? Gosh darn it! We are going to do things my way. With aggressive pacifism. I'll get the bandages. You shall not pass! <laughs> Wait, Nerf, stop! No! I'm dead talking! My emotions can only be expressed through a sinister tendency! I don't want to talk, or shout, or any of that! I just want to give you a hug! Come here, little guy! Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh! Nerf, I'm so sorry! Are you okay? Well, that really hurt. Jeez, I can't believe I've been subjecting people to physical violence like this. I feel kind of bad about my behavior. What? Yeah, I, I think I'm gonna go sit down in my tent and think about what I did to it. Sorry, everybody. <laughs> huh, I guess you did it, David. I guess he knocked some sense in him. But I didn't- Hey, David. Thanks for everything. No. Wait! We need to talk about this! This is not okay! Nah, man, I'm good. I'm gonna tell everyone about how you helped me today. Goodbye, friends. Well, I guess it turns out at the end of the day, sometimes you just gotta hit kids. <laughs> <laughs> You're officially welcome to grab your crutches. Synchronize your watches and pour us a couple scotches. People still in statues can't catch you. For about like three minutes. <laughs> Not even. It was like legitimately only about a minute and a half, maybe two. I didn't even turn it off. It's like 
hardcore not wanting to turn off. You know what, we're just we're gonna end it. So we only had all these technical difficulties. <laughs> Will you stop? <laughs> Act your age. But I did it. <laughs> not turning off like at all. Okay, right, can, can, can we can we just end the video? <laughs> <laughs> I will slap you like nerf. I will slap you like nerf. <laughs> what if you end it? What did you guys think? It was definitely a funny episode. Yep. Mm -hmm. It definitely was not helped by all the technical difficulties. Though. It was really not. I didn't trust you. I just like ready to go for those cops. I was like, <laughs> fight you. Oh, oh, what are you doing? David with Nerf. I'm not going to stop on YouTube. Are you kidding me? On YouTube. I like how <laughs> he specified on YouTube. <laughs> well, that's why they're watching this. Yeah, but that's I like hope. saying I'm going to slap him once this recording like, turns off. That's like saying he's going to stop the recording and he's going to turn and be like... <laughs> <laughs> At this point, this kid hit back. I'm going to be honest. If he hit him, I'd hit him. I'm talking about you. I know. You hit him. I'd stab you. That's how this works. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe in hitting kids. Yeah, because they didn't fix anything. Well, apparently for this kid. But you don't have a weird shaped belly button. It's always sticking out your shirt. So. <laughs> The, the kid, because you made the, the shirt was too small and he had the weird. Like, yeah, that's what defines him. <laughs> it was the belly button. I know you didn't even like. I didn't even go high enough. I know. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, you're just like. So. <laughs> anything to say overall besides not slapping children? Wiener hosen. <laughs> <laughs> so. If you like our content, like, comment, and subscribe. When we get 250 subscribers... <laughs> no! No! When we get 250 <sighs> subscribers, we will tell you about poop cookies and drop and try. Now like, comment, subscribe. Ring that bell. Share. Sharing is caring. We have a Twitter. We have a Facebook. <coughs> We may be in your favorite reactor's Discord, depending on who that reactor is. Not that we say much in Discord anymore these days. I wish I'm busy. I, I say we'll stuff in Discord, just not a reactor Discord. You say stuff at Animal Crossing. Oh my god, guys, look, I have Celeste. Hair flip. There's something wrong with him. Yeah. He says this. Well, you knew that. Mm. So, true. She says this, but that when we hit 300 subscribers, I'll tell you about the one time she helped with the Christmas decorations. Oh God! <laughs> you don't yeah. want them. <laughs> That's uncomfortable. Ah, it's also uncomfortable. But you want to know what that did? It killed them. Just leave it alone. Just come back to another episode. Thank <laughs> you.